Hi friends, Lark here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about the Pinyin National Flag. Let's see how will you know the Pinyin National Flag. If you're here the first time, please remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That year 2020 is a big one! Not only, Canada celebrates 153rd anniversary of Confederation, it is also marking 55th anniversary of Canadian flag. What type of maple leaf is in the center of the Canadian flag? A mountain maple leaf? A stylized maple leaf, a sugar maple leaf, or a silver maple leaf? The answer is a stylized maple leaf. To be fair, this is a little bit of a tricky question because the leaf on the center of the candy flag does not represent any specific species of maple. However, it's inspired by the sugar maple leaf. The number of points on the maple leaf depicted on the candy flag represents the number of provinces and territories in Canada. True or false? The answer is false. The design of the stylus maple leaf on Canada's national flag is meant to help keep the symbol visible and distant when seen from far away and in windy condition. Its 11 points are solely a feature of graphic design and do not reflect Canada's provinces and territories. In 1921, which colors were proclaimed by King George V as the official colors of Canada? Red, white and blue, red and white, green and yellow, or gold and blue? The answer is red and white. Red and white became Canada's national color by proclamation of King George V in 1921. Beside the historical connection to France and Britain, two of Canada's founding European nations. Red and white might also represent red of autumn maple leaves and white of the snow. In what year was the current Canadian flag officially adopted? 1965, 1972, 1921, or 1942? The answer is 1965. The national flag of Panda was declared official by a proclamation of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II on January 28, 1965. When is the national flag of Panda Day celebrated each year? July 1st, December 8th, September 10th, February 15th. February 50, the national flag of Canada was first raised on Parliament Hill in Ottawa on February 50, 1965. February 50 was declared National Flag of Canada Day in 1996 to honor its important anniversary. When the national flag of Canada is displayed with the flags of the 10 provinces and 3 territories, the flags of the provinces and territories Fallen alphabetical order. True or false? The answer is false. The flag of the provinces and territories are displayed according to the order in which they enter confederation, starting with the provinces and followed by the territories. If more than one province joined in given them, the flags are ordered by the population at the time of their joining. This gives the following order, Ontario 1867, Cuba 1867, Nova Scotia 1867, New Brunswick 1867, Manitoba 1870, British Columbia 1871, Prince Edward Island 1873, Saskatchewan 1905, Alberta 1905, Newfoundland and Labrador 1949, 
Northwest Territories 1870, Yukon 1898, and Nunavut 1999. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed and learned more about the Canadian National Flag. If you want to learn more about the Canadian National Flag, please visit the link in the description. Until we meet in the next video, take care and stay safe. Bye friends!